deity, but with me, Lord or Lady, per chamber. That neat bird beguiling my sad fancy into smiling by the grave and stern decorum of the continents at war. Thou thy crest be sure nor shaven, thou, said I, art short nor craven, ghastly grim and ancient raven wandering from the nightly shore. Tell me what tell me what thy lordly name is on the Nonian shore. Quoth I marvel this ungainly fowl to hear discourse so plainly, though its meaning little revelancy bore. <clears throat> Bear with me, I'm not You, oh, sir, yeah. must what? become a reg. Sorry for interrupting. Please continue. Also, give me some of that Guinness. Where was I? Ah, yes. For we cannot help agreeing that no living human being ever yet was blessed with seeing bird above his chamber door, bird or beast above the sculptured bust above his chamber door. Raven sitting lonely on the placid bust spoke only that one word as if his soul in that one word he did outpour. Further than he uttered, not a feather than he fluttered, till I scarcely more than muttered. Oh, he will leave me, yes. So now your microphone keeps like getting quiet and you can't hear you. Uh, we can't hear you. And all right. Excuse me. I'll try to fix it. No problem. No problem. I'm sorry. It's my fault, guys. It's my fault. <laughs> Shut up, you Mexican. I never did trust those Mexicans.